everything you saw in the previous video was based on science, scientific discoveries, because scientists are working hard to understand who we are and what our world is. And these discoveries confirm the theory of the simulated war. In this case, the possibility that someone has infiltrated this network is also strengthened. No doubt this issue is difficult for human beings to understand today. Now imagine how it was possible for someone to understand this issue in the distance past. Why do you not understand my speech? Because you are unable to hear what I say. You must have heard a lot about the ancients, whether from historical books or religious books. But in one corner of the war, there is a library deep underground that holds papyri and important historical manuscripts that contain the mysteries of Christianity, and you are no doubt unaware of them. In 1945, 13 encrypted papyrus, sealed in a jar, were discovered by a local farmer named Muhammad al samman The most famous part of this papyrus is undoubtedly the writings of Thomas. But another part of this papyrus is called the Gnostic Gospel, which contains poems and secret events from the Gospels, attributed to the personal saying and teaching of Jesus Christ. In some of these texts, it is stated that Sufia is an evil spirit who indirectly created the universe. She also created an evil creature called Demiurge. And it was Demiurge who, by trapping the elements of Peleroma and capturing them in the body, created man. That is, the same auras of energy in the main world that now have bodies in this world. So God had to send a manifestation in the form of a man to save mankind, so that he could teach mankind how to attain the knowledge of a spiritual mysterious, by which they might return to the Peleroma or the original war. So, is it not possible that the mentioned world is the same simulated world designed by an evil creature? It is interesting to note that Hugh Jashenfield is one of the researchers working on the Dead Sea Scrolls. During his research, he discovered that the word Baphomet was coined with Atbash encryption knowledge. And when he deciphered the words, Baphomet changed to Sophia. But today, Sophia seems to have a high position in religions. And it should be noted that in Luciferianism, Sufia is highly respected because Sufia is considered as the female of Lucifer. It is not interesting that the first robot that looks exactly like a human with a human-like procession and emotion named Sophia And is it a coincidence that the creature of the movie Matrix is a woman named Sophia? No doubt you know Jesus well, but let hear the moment of his birth according to the writing of the most important eyewitness, Joseph, the fiancé and the only supporter of the Virgin Mary in this process.
According to the Gospel of James, during childbirth, Joseph found a cave. He took Mary into the cave and followed midwife himself. When he returned with midwife, a black cloud surrounded the cave. They ran into the cave when suddenly a light covered the whole cave so that their eyes could not see. Shortly after the light goes out and they are able to see, they saw the baby Jesus in the arm of his mother, the Virgin Mary. Yes, Jesus penetrated the network as beautiful as possible by being born like others so that the matrix could not recognize him. He gave a special training. This is this my, is body. my body. body. This is this my, my bella. bella. And on the last day, he did not resist arrest. In the video of the ancient aliens, we saw that the angels and the holy people appeared again and again next to the cave. And as we know, they appeared only for a very short time. But Jesus was able to stay in this world for 33 years in this way. Now the question is, if he came to save humans, then why are we in the matrix now? Notice Jesus' last sentence on the cross. Father! Father! Forgive them. For they know not what they do. Yes, the mission failed. But after the resurrection, eleven of the apostles pledged to deliver the message of salvation to all human on earth. But what was the message? John the Apostle, not only after being poisoned by the Roman Emperor, did not die, but also resurrected two people who had died before him. But how? According to Pareri of Zion, Jesus wanted everyone to know that everyone has the ability to do what he say and does, which will be possible with coordination and evolution. Christ said the kingdom of heaven is within you, and if you look inside yourself, what you see is vibration, frequency, and energy. If you read the Book of Symbols, which was published in 1593, you will find the symbol with full explanation. The symbol of the triangle with an eye inside, and this symbol is actually the symbol of Christ and Christians. Triangles of a triangle meaning the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit and the inner eye, which is the eye of providence. But in the following centuries, some, such as the Freemasons, used this symbol so that the original root of this symbol was forgotten. But what is evolution? Notice what Christ say, always be happy. Pray constantly, be thankful in any situation. Mitra appeared in a cave on Mount Diamavan around 11,000 BC. And we see that meditation is very much emphasized in the prayers of religion of love in ancient Persia, that you know Mitra as Mitraism in Roman Empire. 
Then there was written evidence of any kind of meditation in the Vedas of Hinduism around 50,000 BC and then in Buddhism in 563 BC. This is the page of the Greek magical papyri, which is written in ancient Egyptian, Old Coptic, Demotic, and ancient Greek. Look at this picture. What do you see? No, this picture does not show the crucifixion of Christ, although it's exactly the same. In the most important part of this papyrus, which is Mitra's prayer for immortality, there are teachings such as connection with the world of death and immortalization of human beings. Or perhaps it means connection with the world of the living and immortality. Have you ever noticed a baby screaming during childbirth? If you knew you were going to die now, you would scream worse than them. Now pay attention to what Christ said. The only way to salvation is to born again. This sentence certainly does not mean being born again in this world. Although this sentence is interpreted as baptism, but could it make more sense? No doubt, one of the most important statements of Christ is this sentence. It seems that Christ gave bread to the apostles and said that, this is my body. And he gave wine and said, this is my blood. But is it possible that he mentioned a more important issue? According to researchers and archaeologists, there is a vital substance in human blood called ambrosia that goes beyond its function in the body, and they believe that this strange substance appeared in the blood of all humans about 2000 years ago. To better understand ambrosia, watch our upcoming video called The Sons of Mitra.